Hey guys, this is James again. I'm here to give you another tutorial on how to install memory chips into the MacBook Pro. And this is the 2009 version 2.26 gigahertz. So first off, you want to shut off and power it off the computer completely. And don't mind the screen. Uh, there is something wrong with editing video, uh, software that I'm using. So there's nothing wrong with the computer. So first you want to flip it over on its back and you want to use the screwdriver here that I'm showing you. Uh, you can get this from the local CVS store for 99 cents and it's typically used for adjusting sunglasses or even reading glasses. So you want to carefully unscrew all the screws and you want to make sure you put it in the proper place so that you know what goes where later on. So this is the part that you want to be really careful. Uh, you want to make sure you have no static before you touch any part of the computer. Uh, uh, I mean inside of the computer. So you want to gently uh, take the chips out. And these are the new chips. You want to slide it right back in. As you can see, it's a little crooked. And I, I was having difficulties uh, trying to fit it back in. But I managed my way in. So. Uh, you want to make sure the locks on both the left side and the right side are open so you can slide it back in uh, easily. So as soon as the chips are back into the slot, as you can see I was using my thumb to make sure the locks are secured. And now you can put the lid back on and make sure it is straight so that way you don't have to uh, pop it open again um, halfway through screwing it because the lid is not closed properly so then here you want to screw all the screws back in and there, here's one thing I want to emphasize hopefully this video helps you after you watch it uh, this is a very very simple uh, procedure to install memories on the laptop so you, I, I wouldn't want anybody to waste 40 to 50 dollars into a, in a computer store or even an Apple store for someone else to to do it for you and something this easy so hopefully this video will and save you $40, $40 you can get a couple um, blu-ray DVD movies or even a full tank of gas and hopefully um, this video helps you a lot and if you have any questions please uh, leave a comment on, on my channel or um, rate or even shoot me a message and I will respond to you in a timely manner. And there are more videos in the future for do it yourself and it will be different things so stay tuned and thanks for watching.